This is Craigie Glen in winter. And here we are at one of the, uh, the many viewpoints over the water at Craigie Glen. place to uh, come to reflect and get your head shard. Mm. And uh, I've, I've, got, uh, I've got Stephen and Molly with me. If Molly would stay still for two seconds. Hi there she is. Hi. I've got Stephen and Molly with me and Stephen has recently taken up writing poems. How many poems have you got under your belt at the minute, Stephen? Well, maybe about seven or eight at the moment. Right. Yeah. And um, the muse has uh, has suddenly come upon you, well, so to speak. Well, uh, sometimes, you know, when I'm walking along, right. I, uh, something pops into my head right. and uh, I start thinking about it. And then I think, oh, I could write something about that. Yeah. So that's that, that's what I've been doing. But you haven't written poetry really before. Not really, not really, not really. And but uh, you know, I, I enjoy it, and I'm up here in the Glen, you know, several times a week yeah, yeah. with the dog. So there's plenty of time yeah. to think. Through all seasons, you know, yeah. so you see the Glen and all its different uh, uh, times with the flowers out and then the yeah, bears yeah, yeah, in the yeah, winter yeah. and all yeah, of that. Yeah. 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 Brilliant. Right, in a minute or two, um, I'm going to video uh, Stephen and he's going to read his uh, Craigie Glen poem to us. And here we have uh, Stephen, Stephen Knox, reading his uh, beautiful poem, um, Craigie Glen. I've hurried back to raise my pen, to write a song for Craigie Glen. River rushing in my ear. Bird song fills the autumn air, cannot wait to go again and walk the path of Craigie Glen. Every day when I arise, I ponder on the glen's surprise, that moment when the sunlight glints through leaves that look like patchwork prints. I try to catch it now and then, the wonder of the Craigie Glen. The glen is wild and cold and wet, steps and paths need care, and yet, when springtime comes, it lives anew, a coloured carpet, brilliant blue, a sight to glad the hearts of men, the bluebell heaven of the glen. The summer sends a peaceful glow, trees shade the walkers far below, the rainless loop drops slowly down as it heads towards the town, but wait for rain and love it when, Har returns to Craig Glen. And when I'm old and legs are sore, the Craigie Glen is mine no more. I think of walking in the past, and memories come flooding fast. I'd close my eyes and count to ten, and find myself in Craigie Glen. Lovely. Thank you, Thank Stephen. You.